Rocky Fredo is undefeated in two bouts. Scheduled for six rounds. Taped earlier in the evening. Rocky Fredo had uh, Carmen Basilio in his corner, by the way. From a welterweight and middleweight champion of the world who was here. The crowd behind us reacting to an announcement that they don't like. These boys are welterweights. Rocky Fredo in the white trunks from Syracuse. Johnny Taylor from Buffalo. In the feeling out process in round one, the referee Tommy Holmes. And there goes Fredo down from a sharp left hook at the jaw. And is he mad? He was just caught cold by that left hook. Right like Johnny Taylor, which gives Johnny a pretty good edge here in the first round. Here's Fredo back into action, and Taylor comes at him trying to finish him. Fredo's the favorite in this fight. And there goes uh, Johnny Taylor down. They both went down in the first round. They were both last round down, and neither one was hurt. Both had to take the mandatory eight count and then go back into action. A fine welterweight duel here in the War Memorial Auditorium in Syracuse, New York. I'm Don Dunphy at ringside along with Len Dillon. Next week we'll be in Jersey City. We'll have a pair of heavyweights and a pair of welterweights. So we will tell you more about them later. Fredo to the attack now opens up on Taylor. He has taken the play away from him. Taylor scored the opening knockdown, but since then it's been all Fredo. Less than a minute to go in round one. Scheduled for six rounds. Welterweights. Boys throwing heavy leather now. Taylor tries to relax by dropping those gloves down, but he gets out of range when he does it. Fredo's a very serious individual in there, no fooling around. He knows he's got a, knows he's got a job to do. Syracuse boy just can't get past the guard, however. White trunks. This was a split round. One judge had it uh, even, and the other uh, gave it to Fredo, and the referee did too. Fredo in the white trunk, Johnny Taylor in the black trunk. Scheduled for six rounds as well, the weight bout. Both boys took hard shots there, and I thought Taylor's knees buckled just a little bit. Tommy Holmes. That body shot will be a telling one later on, perhaps. Fredo's throwing the heavy leather right now. And that right to the Taylor down, and this time he doesn't look as though he'll make it. Taylor is being counted out. He tries to get up, but he does not make it. He does not beat the count, and the time 
is 2.30 of the second round. The winner, Ralph Rocky Fredo of Syracuse over Johnny Taylor of Buffalo and about that was taped earlier this evening. Fredo has won all three of his bouts by knockout. See that, that left hook set him up. The one, two, the right followed over, crashing against the left side of the jaw. And that was the end of the evening as far as Johnny Taylor was concerned.